has grand plans for India. They've announced that they will launch four new SUVs over the next two years. And one of them is this, the Volkswagen Tiguan. It's part of their India 2.0 plans, where they've invested $1 billion to develop a new platform for India. It's called the MQB A0IN. And this is the first Volkswagen brand product that will come out of their range. I've already done a detailed review about the Tiguan. You're going to see a link on your screen right now to go check it out. In the meantime, let's go see all the other SUVs heading our way. So the second SUV I want to talk to you about is this, the Tiguan Allspace. The Tiguan's been in India for a while, we know what it is, we're familiar with it. Uh, this Allspace is a slightly longer wheelbase version of the Tiguan. So the longer wheelbase frees up more knee room, it also allows for the addition of a third row. So the Tiguan Allspace can seat seven people. Interestingly, the Tiguan Allspace will only come with a 2-litre TSI engine and a 7-speed DSG gearbox. There will be no diesel on offer when it launches. The third SUV showcased at Volkswagen stall is this. This is the Volkswagen T-Roc and yes, it is heading to India. It will be based on the European spec MQB platform and it will be a premium position car in uh, Volkswagen's lineup. It's got a 1.5 litre TSI engine, a 7-speed DSG uh, and it is a longer car than the Tiguan. It's around 4.2, 4.3 meters long. It will be brought in either as a CBU or a CKD, so it will also be a little expensive and therefore it will also be brought in in limited numbers. So it's not going to be a mass car, but it's going to be a brand building, very cool looking SUV from Volkswagen. As you can see, the funk on the outside of the T-Roc continues on the inside. You've got this contrasting colour on the dashboard, it's orange here to match the paint on the outside, you've got orange on the seats as well. But apart from that, it's a familiar cockpit. It looks uh, very similar to the Tiguan in some ways. You've got analogue clocks, a familiar steering wheel, the DSG gearbox. You've also got a panoramic sunroof and overall it looks like a spacious but colourful cabin to be in. The fourth SUV heading our way is one that I'm very, very excited about. It's the ID Cross. Just look at it. It's gorgeous, isn't it? It's based on Volkswagen's new MEB platform. It's a new platform where the batteries are on the floor and you can have different configurations of motors. In this car, it's got two motors, one on the front axle, one on the rear axle, giving it all-wheel drive and over 500 kilometers of range. This is the electric future. And if it looks this way, I'm quite excited about it. So these are the four SUVs heading your way from Volkswagen in the next two years. There is a timeline. The Allspace as well as the T-Roc are going to come in within the next four months. The Tiguan, one year from now. And following that will be the ID Cross. It's certainly exciting, exciting times. Subscribe to the Evo India channel and hit the bell icon to keep pace with the thrill of driving.